we are so lucky here in Pershaw that we have this amazing park in which the Abbey stands. I know that many of you come into the park for all sorts of reasons to enjoy its space and its beauty. I just wanted to share with you today a couple of things that are happening in the park. Behind me we have a wildflower project which the Eco Church Group at Pershaw Abbey um, in partnership with Witchaven and Pershaw Rotary Club have been working on. Some of you might have noticed that the grass hasn't been cut for a bit and the whole idea is to see what wildflowers might come up. We've also been able to plant some wildflower seed so we're hoping that later in the summer there will be some beautiful flowers for us to enjoy. And this project is all about enjoying God's creation, letting nature come back and just having the time and space to sit and enjoy the beauty and wonder of it all. There is so much history connected with this whole park and the land around the Abbey. I'm sure as you've, you've come through you would have noticed lots of really old uh, memorial stones and, and, and tablets all remembering people who were connected with Pershaw and the Abbey going back many, many centuries. This place is a very popular place for people just to come and be and, and sit and enjoy the sun and, and look out on people going about their business on the park. I always love coming here and I love seeing the uh, kite in the tree, which reminds us that whilst we're remembering a lot of history and the shadow of the Abbey, we're also remembering that families and young people come just to enjoy life. And that feels like a really important thing that we do here in the park. We know that many people come every day into the Abbey Church to have time for prayer and quiet and reflection. People come in to remember loved ones, to hold the things that are dear to them very much in their hearts. And the same is in our outdoor space here in the churchyard. Many families and people have chosen this holy space to lay to rest the ashes of their loved ones and just looking around today you can see why it is a beautiful space surrounded by trees which are in blossom at the moment there's a sense of calm and tranquility of being at rest and I'm really pleased and moved that we can offer that to so many people in Pershaw and beyond that this can be the final resting place for so many people's precious and loved ones. And it's not just us humans who really enjoy the park, the churchyard, all this wonderful land around the Abbey. As part of our Eco Church project, we've also been um, really encouraging our wildlife. We've had bird feeders out and just taking note of what happens to be around us. I'm sure you can hear, hopefully, the bird song today is absolutely glorious. So if you get chance over the next few days to come into this wonderful green space, do take the time to look at the wildlife, enjoy all the different spaces and perhaps to be still and to give thanks to God for it all.